Y'all, this is ridiculous. It was 70 something degrees yesterday. Now the weather's changed and it's supposed to snow in the northern counties and it's a freezing rain in other parts of Alabama. This weather is crazy, y'all. Hey, you guys, and happy Thursday. Today's Thursday. I realized while editing yesterday's vlog that I said today was that day was Tuesday, which in fact it was Wednesday. You know, I'm not in in tune with the day of the week. You know, I don't keep up with all that. I just came from taking Zoe outside, right? And while we were out there shivering and fighting through the cold, the guy that lived next door to us with his parents or whatever, whoever they are. He came outside to his car. Zoe, of course, was barking her face off. You know, I was sitting out there minding my own business, waiting on Zoe to get done using it so we can go back in the house where it's warm. And he was like, excuse me, I got a question. That was the guy. I turned around and I looked at him like, yeah. He was like, how old is your son? I don't know if I looked at him like, I remember looking like, what son do I have? I don't remember having a son, but okay. And then I got to thinking, oh, oh, you're talking about the big guy that, that comes out of the house sometimes? He's like, yeah, oh, that's my boyfriend. And he was shocked. He was like, oh, okay. And then I told him, you know, Derek is 25. And he was like, well, how old are you? And I was like, dude, you're really asking my age? But luckily I'm not the type of woman that don't like giving her age because I'm proud that I'm the age that I am, which is 30. So uh, I told him that I was 30. He was like, oh, okay then, okay. You know, trying to play everything off, but really inside he was shocked that somebody that with a disability has a boyfriend. I'm sure he was, I'm sure he was. I find it funny that people who are able-bodied, some people now, automatically think that when they see someone with a disability, with someone of the opposite sex, they automatically think, oh, that person is their nurse or cousin or brother or sister. How come they can't be a boyfriend or girlfriend? I used to wonder why people think that, but now I don't. I just laugh at it and chalk it up as people, I guess, being a little ignorant, that's all. But yeah, it's like, I don't do naughty things with my cousin. I mean, even though this is Alabama, no, we don't do that. About to take Zoe to go potty. I hope she uses it because it's too cold to be sitting out there while she's spinning around in circles for 30 minutes. Yeah, they. Oh, she ain't doing no wrong. You, you just, you just leave that alone. You just mind your business. She's being a kid. Leave her alone. You fixing to go potty. Hey, ma'am. Hey. Hey, you fixing to go potty. Leave her alone. Yeah, it's freaking cold out here. Ugh. Be back here, day. Go. See, it's too cold out here for all this. She want to bite on sticks. We don't have time to be sitting out here biting on sticks. It's below 30 degrees out here. It, I can't. I cannot. Apparently, the cold ain't affecting her none right now. The cold don't bother you anyway, Zoe. See my humongest mud hole I dug right here? Talks from spinning around in wet dirt for 30 minutes while your dog's trying to find a perfect spot to lay an egg. Did you just bite me for so bad, you? No. The dog game. Sorry. Damn. Ooh. 